Good morning and welcome to the Chart of the Week video with me, David Madden. Today's date is Wednesday the 9th of October 2019 and the time has just gone 10.15 British summer time. And this week's Chart of the Week video is the US dollar, the Canadian dollar, the dollar CAD. And if you take a look at the wider view, we can see that the market is in, broadly speaking, uh, an upward trend. And essentially while the... the uh, while the market holds north of this trend line here, it's likely that the wider positive view is going to continue. But if you zoom in, I would take a closer look at the, some of the price action. We can see that um, the market um, had a very impressive push, push higher uh, at the very beginning of 2019. Uh, at a fairly sizable sell-off, so we had a lower low, a lower high, and another lower low. But we have been pressing higher yet again, and the um, we have we created the uh, a near term higher high in September with the lower low here, and now we are back above this red line here at the 200 day moving average. So it's possible that we could take out the recent high here of early September and look to retest this region here, uh, the the highs of mid June, and that comes into play in around one spot, 34.32. And if we were to go beyond that, we're going to be looking at testing this area here highs of late May and that comes into play at one spot 35.64. Now if you take a closer close, close look at the price action we can see that um, there was a, there was has been some kind of sideways trading recently but we noticed that when the market uh, after 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 this price area here this red line the trading moving average which comes into play in at 132.08 we can see that this metric acted at resistance in mid-September, but now it's actually acting as support. So that metric is, is, um, has, has, has been important in the near, near past. It makes it more likely that, that it could be important in the near future, but obviously there are no guarantees. So what I find interesting about this chart is that the market initially tried to take the 200 moving average. It couldn't. It moved, and it moved to the downside. And then it finally broke above it. It made a clear move above it. This is a very bullish candle here. And since then, it's been holding above that metric. So if you get hold above that metric, it likely we could retest the early September highs and then potentially onto the June highs. But if you do manage to drift lower on the uh, on the on, uh, on the dollar CAD and we drop back below the 200 moving average, it's possible that we could find some support from this zone down around here. We saw some consolidation uh, just north of the 132 mark, this area here. And should we see um, a, a break below that area, it could take us back towards the early September low at this area here in around one spot 31.33. And if we were to go below that, uh, we could be looking at it back down towards the 130, 131 area, uh, which would be a level uh, not seen, uh, last seen in late July. Now, if you are going to be trading the dollar CAD, it is worth, 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 worth your while. Keep an eye out for the US jobs report today, which is out at uh, 1500 for the summer time. The US jobs market is by and large pretty good shape, uh, and this, this is likely to give us an update of how things are going in terms of job, job opening opportunities. And also, and shortly after that, at 15.30 British summer time, we have the US oil inventory uh, report coming out. Uh, the, the Canadian dollar is often dragged around by the, um, is often influenced by the movements in the underlying in, in oil, uh, as Canada has a, has a relatively speaking a rich, an oil rich nation. Um, so any kind of sharp moves in the oil market is likely to have an impact on the Canadian dollar. So if, you, if you're trading, if you're trading uh, this currency pair, please keep an eye out for those economic indicators. Uh, one last thing before I go. If you have any comments to make in this video or any of the other videos we've made here at CMC Markets, please feel free to leave a review on Google Reviews. Thank you very much.